travel bees in today's video um i will present for you a sh shopping haul from the chinese market in uh, red dragon near bucharest uh, we bought some uh, ingredients me and my cousin nick he's here but you know his uh, love for the camera maybe you would like at least to say hello i'm sick he's sick he has coronavirus <coughs> No. It's a joke. He he doesn't. But he it's the flu season and uh, we are expecting all of us to get the flu or the cold at least once. Especially this. from me, you will take it. Uh, for sure, from you. <coughs> oh, that means that I will... Uh, okay, please, please, I will work from home for two weeks. <laughs> okay, uh, moving, uh, coming back to the... Um, Chinese market haul, we took some ingredients to have at least uh, this year, I'm not sure, but uh, we will year. try half a year of having uh, Chinese uh, uh, products, we can find them in the supermarket, but they are kind of expensive, some of them we can find, they are kind of expensive and beside that, they have uh, just uh, small bottles and you know, when you want to cook something, you want uh, a bigger amount so you can find it you can use it all the time and not go every time to buy a small bottle and this the is, taste isn't the same and the taste is better actually and we discovered that uh, some of them they are made in china thailand but for france which is a little bit um, better quality i would say if it would have been made for Romania, it would have been made from uh, Mississippi River. <laughs> Junk uh, places uh, from Europe. Usually the lowest, lowest quality is in Bulgaria for products. And the second lowest quality after Bulgaria is Romania. So <laughs> that's why we're, um, we are glad when we see made for France in Thailand or something and that means also that they are respecting our um, European food regulations, which is a good sign also. So moving with the, uh, starting with the bottles, because I have a lot. I have some uh, here, pure sesame oil. I hope it's roasted. This is the pure Maybe sesame burnt. oil. Burned, roasted, but the one that you extract without the heat doesn't have the toasted sesame uh, smell. I bought once and it was like, you don't have the taste. So, um, we started with uh, pure sesame oil. This is one of them. Premium. And um, oyster sauce. Oh, this is oyster? Yeah. yeah. Oyster sauce. My colleagues from work wanted also some, so I have a lot of bottles. Actually, oyster sauce. I wanted to try um, sriracha. sriracha hot chili sauce, royal Thai, but the small container because I'm not sure how much I will love it. So uh, a, a small bottle goes a long way usually. Um, what else? I have some 380 milliliters of soy sauce. I don't remember the prices, but I busted a lot of money, me and him. So, but we went out of the store with two big sacks of bags. things, bags. It was like a sack. Mm. Soy sauce, but it's the liquid kind. I usually like the thicker one that I can find in Mega Image. Oh. It's 20 lei. Uh, it's kind of expensive, I don't but like I it. like that one. Teriyaki barbecue sauce, which with, is thick. With garlic? No, this one is with honey. Uh -huh. With honey bunny! <laughs> which uh, sleeps right now. What else? I found MSG. It's, I'm so excited for this one. You, you can't actually buy MSG in Romania. You cannot find it you only can, in the Chinese stores. Exactly. You cannot find it in... You can find it actually on uh, Emag. Nah. Emag is our big... Amazon. Uh, it's like an Amazon, but it's for uh, Romania. And it's quite nice. A mug is actually, we have Amazon also, but uh, because we want certain stuff, if it's from the States, the problem with that is that uh, they charge the transportation fee triple than the product. So 
we look and we say okay bye <laughs> we don't buy it uh i started with the salty stuff no i started with the salty stuff first i took these um these are uh mushroom wo wooden ears wooden ear mushroom it's 24 lei how much is 24 lei it's oh, five euros five euros that means 4.5 dollars i think it's a 0.5 between euro and dollar i think so these you have to hydrate in hot water and they become big and crunchy and uh, they have a nice texture they don't have any kind of taste of mushroom but they are very pleasant ah yeah, very pleasant. can i ask you just to present your sponge cake and the shiitake mushrooms also no i didn't buy shiitake you didn't Ah, okay. You wanted to buy shiitake. Ah, okay. <laughs> they were a little bit pricey. <laughs> so, that was uh, the wooden ear mushrooms with a nice texture. And then uh, we have uh, here shrimp chips, which we grew up with it. Even yeah. my parents grew up with shrimp <coughs> chips. They come like this. And when you put it, uh, them in hot oil, they expand. And, uh, you know, a little goes a long way because they become big like this. And uh, maybe I will take you along when I am doing one <coughs> and um, show you the process. But for sure you have something like this. So a big bag like this, I think costed 29 lei, uh, like 5 euros, right? seven euros and uh, i don't know how much ah one kilo one kilo for sure i will have at least a few months because we don't because it's dry we avoid doing it all the time but uh, it will go a lot a lot yeah, of time a long way. way now i bought this uh, seven grams of um, noodles rice noodles oriental style instant noodles vermicelli they are like this and uh, i think i usually use uh, one or two depending how much the portion is but two is for five five six people eating uh, once um i do usually hands in the tree this is the style of dish that i'm doing with these uh, noodles and uh, now we can uh, start uh, going to the soups the instant soups because you know you're going there you need to try to buy some and this is new for me i never eat it it's a shrimp ramen soup it's not written in english at all so yeah. let's use our imagination <coughs> i think they have uh, the shrimp cakes ramen and uh, something i will do a separate video with uh, eating the trying the ramen things now i have uh, campaghetti noodles i'm not sure what is what it's with soy sauce it's not very uh, salty but it's very delicious and with a rich uh, flavor i tried already this one and it was uh, very nice that's why i wanted to have it again so i can share it with you this is samyang ramen sweet sauce sweet soy bean sauce okay this is another uh, thing it looks like this this is new, I don't know how is it. <laughs> Hot beef noodles. Uh, the company I cannot read because it's not uh, the alphabet that I've learned. I know only the standard alphabet. Kirillic. Huh? Kirillic? No. The, I don't know the Russian, Kirillic, Bulgarian mm -hmm. alphabet. I know the standard alphabet. ABC, you know, those one, Latin, I think it is, and the Greek alphabet, which is another alphabet. I know two alphabets and that's enough for me. Maybe one day I will, uh, I will learn Arabic. It's hard, but it's very well paid, so who knows? 
Meanwhile, uh, this is... Oh! Actually, this is good for a diet because it has um, konjac flour. Konjac flour, it doesn't have gluten at all. So, this is good for my gluten intolerance. You don't want to know how many preservatives they have. E1420. 1420. I never thought we have this kind of E in Europe. I didn't think. Anyway, it's with meat. What kind of meat? I can't God say. knows. <laughs> you, you, you can tell by the fact that this soup will never go bad in like 100 years. So. God knows what meat. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I will try it with you and you will see and this is another type of uh, ramen this is a nice one fancy one i will read it first Fi uh, spicy pork bone noodle and it looks like this it's kind of empty so it has no that's very uh, probably it has the spices you have to add the corn, the pork. You have to add the You only everything. have the noodles and the spices. Yeah, but it's nice. I would try this. Uh, it looks very cool. And I think it's uh, chicken base. You have the beef base. <laughs> this, actually, I saw in a lot of videos and I had I had to try it's a uh, beef with bamboo uh, shots and rice this is a meal uh, you have the hot uh, thing you pour water you put the hot socket you put then the dish with water everything and uh, you close the cap and it's uh, boiling by itself this is interesting for me I always wanted to try this so I bought one with beef they had with chicken also yeah but beef is more interesting yeah of course can you see with first salty I wanted to try this uh, snacks with seaweeds and wasabi flavor we will try it tomorrow um the snacks the sweets and the snacks we will try tomorrow together me and nick because he's coming tomorrow also you will also i will film about we can try that but we will vomit if we are trying it now because it's durian fruit what is that the smelly fruit uh, from uh, not in my room, in the kitchen. But is it good? Some people say it's a love-hate relationship. It's either you like it, either you hate it. It's nothing in between. Some people think, uh, scent something like oniony flavor. Some people uh, feel that you're eating a dumpster. Ah, so it's kind of like my uh, ex-girlfriend. Sometimes I liked her, sometimes I didn't. And like her uh, temperament, sometimes she was like an onion, and sometimes she was like a cutie pie. Okay. <laughs> well. well, she was a toaster all the time. Okay. <laughs> Seaweed with um, wasabi flavored. I wanted to try them. I'm open to things. So uh, this is one. Then uh, we have. Yeah. We have the black sesame powdered dessert, which is a pudding. The problem is they wrote it in English and something here in other languages. And um, you see here? Here was where you could see how to make it. So, and I tried to open uh, the bag uh, to scratch the foil out and uh, actually it's breaking. So. And the only thing that we're afraid of is that the taste is a bit too sesame. I like sesame. Yeah, but the taste, if it is too sesame -ish. If it's not bitter, mm. it's okay for me. I hope. But, uh, ah, four servings. Ooh. Now, I saw this and I said, okay, I have to try it because everyone is to talking about it. It's froze dried golden pillow durian. And it looks like this. Where are my... Ah, I have it here. I also... What? Kiss. Kiss? Kiss. Okay. We have sugar print mint. Kiss delicious. Jasmine green grape flavor. 
It looks like this. <coughs> and I... Uh, <coughs> I want to open it for you, for us, for everyone. We will do the review tomorrow, but we will try it today and we will not say anything. Uh. They look so cute. I think they are mints. Păi cred că te scrie mici pe ele. Ok, I broke the, I busted the... Oh, they are nice! Look how nice! Cute! It, it, it is very... nice to be on the other side when you are watching someone trying new stuff. You always want to try it. It is, it, it is nice to, for oh you to God. be the one who tries it. Oh my God! Ah, well, uh, Ah! Ah, okay, mm. okay. Forget tomorrow reviews. <laughs> He doesn't like it. Me too, Philly. He says it's for women. They had the uh, lemon and mint. No, um, mojito flavor and something else. It's like eating flowers. Yes, because it's with jasmine, grape. And uh, mint. Jasmine can go back to the dumpster. I want 10 of these. I want back. I need to buy all of these. Jasmine can fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like Jasmine. She can just fuck off. <laughs> And it's sugar free. Oh my god. Yeah. It's the best candy that I ate. And it's minty. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry, you can't see his face. It's like he's eating an onion right now. <laughs> ah, no, they're terrible if you eat them dry. Uncooked? Uncooked. Uh -huh. I tried. Ah. <laughs> okay. Tapioca pearls. Uh, already black sugar flavored. Looks like this. We are doing boba tea. I did it once for my cousin and now uh, we went to McDonald's to eat something and what did you say? I'm very proud of what I heard, that's why. You are my best cousin? Who is my best cousin? You are my best cousin. Can you make me boba tea as a person? You know, After I was a like, bit of sugar, you, you put the request. <laughs> I knew he wanted something, but... <laughs> so, this um, hosted... 3 euros. Yeah, because 15 days. Yeah. 3 euros and we will do boba with them. I bought these uh, handmade egg rolls with sesame, of course. They have with matcha also, but sometimes matcha could be if it's over... Ah, egg rolls. If, okay. uh, if it's uh, overpowering, it's too bitter for me. And it looks like this. Here. Now, uh, I only have uh, Jasmine in my mouth. I can only taste her. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> And I saw some um, new Pocky. Oh, they are heart-shaped Pocky. I knew what I chose. Yeah, because I couldn't... I found three, you know. I could have I could have buy all three of them because... Uh, Shopping after spree. All, yeah, I didn't know how much money I had in the wallet. I had the card with me. Okay, uh, but we weren't <coughs> sure that we can buy with the card. Ah. I forgot to bring the steamer. Mm. I bought a dumpling steamer also. It's not very interesting, it's just a steamer. <laughs> <laughs> it's out of bamboo, it's just a steamer. <laughs> okay, you, let's use our uh, imagination here. And the pokey... Look, here, here is the steamer, it's in my hand, no it isn't anymore. <laughs> <sighs> The pocky is with blueberries and the type of flower, Niku, I think. Uh, type of flower called Niku? <laughs> no, white flower. Lily of the Valley. Ah, Jasmine. <laughs> you, you Jasmine that. again. Um, blueberry and something, but it's so cute. Can't wait to try these. What? <laughs> And um, that was all. I have doubled the um, wooden uh, ear mushrooms and the shrimp chips to have for the whole year. 
and uh, I have a few more bottles of oyster sauce uh, for my colleagues at work, uh, meaning three bottles. Other than that, this is all. Now that I'm looking, it it's isn't not that much, much but, but it's honest work. <laughs> it's not much, but it's honest work, yeah. But if you think about it, we went out of the store with two big bags. Well, that is it for today. Tomorrow we will do... Uh, now we will do Pocky. You will see it in another... Uh, not Pocky, Bobati. You will see it in another video. Tomorrow we will taste test the snacks that are very few. And then we will do bao buns because we have a steamer now. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed this video and see you guys later. Bye!